Hey everyone, how's it going? So in the Tesla Model Y, and we'll be swapping this round steering wheel to a yoke. So in the Y and 3, you cannot get a yoke. It's not even an option. So Handshow actually is well known to customize yoke for Tesla community. So high quality yokes, high quality leather compared to the vegan type of material here, which will deteriorate quicker than actual Napa leather. So we have a special color here and you can get this in black, white, Alcantara. So let's get this installed. And to get this installed, it's fairly, fairly easy. You just need a flathead screwdriver. You need two if you have them. And you basically, there's a hole back here on the left and right side. Uh, before you do, you want to turn off the vehicle. So go ahead into control. Go under safety, scroll down, hit power off, confirm power off. And now go ahead and pop out the airbag. So you want the screwdriver, the flathead screwdriver to be flush like this. And place it in the hole. And then tilt it towards yourself where you're sitting. Make sure it's still facing that way. You hear it pop on that side. And I like to leave this inside since I have two flathead screwdriver. And then the other side, go ahead and place in the other side. And then this one, same way, tilt it toward yourself. And that is it. And now this will just come right out. And then just pull this air back slowly. There's a yellow wire you want to pull out after you unclip it. So let me show you quickly how to unclip it. Same thing with this burgundy wire. So on the left side, you basically want to put a flathead screwdriver or a large plier, clamp it together and pull it out. And that's how you pull that out. And then you just need a 10 millimeter socket which we have, and we'll go ahead and remove this. So have an extension. You want to be about an inch away from the wheel, or a couple inch would be ideal. And then go ahead, turn it counterclockwise. And once you break the 10 millimeter bolt, use your fingers and unscrew it. As simple as that place this bolt somewhere else and this will just come right off and after you take the wheel out go ahead and pop these clips on the back here out there's three of them so these are the clips that spring in your airbag cover and the reason for this is because you want to remove this and also the front housing so you can install the new casing for the computer chip on the lower part of the wheel and you need to swap this out so this will ensure a clean fit for your airbags and also your horn and this will allow more spacing because the new yoke oem inspire by s and x for the three and y is slightly smaller so it does need this extra space to ensure that it fits properly so this housing is provided with the yoke and you just need to swap out the casing you use the same oem chip that you see here from the original wheel and you just swap it over to the new yoke and it takes less than 10 minutes if you have all the tools ready it's very easy to do and once you have it fit install just plug it in it's really just plug and play and the 10 millimeter bolt put back in place and that is all you need to do. So again, you do need to do this to ensure a proper fit for this OEM yoke style for your 3 and y And go ahead and place the new yoke on. So you just want to line it up with the 12 o'clock and 6 o'clock. There's a guy, uh, a different groove that is. So you can't mess this up. It goes straight in. And some of these stuff in here looks like rust, but it's not rust. It's actually a lube or a type of lube that keep it smooth for when you put it in and then later if you want to take out, switch it back to OEM, you can. 
So it takes less than 20 minutes to install this. So right now it's only been about 15 minutes and we just need to plug everything back in after we screw in and we're good to go. Okay, go ahead and screw in the 10 millimeter bolt. So hand tighten it and then torque it to 45 to 50 and you should be good to go. Don't over torque it. Okay, now plug everything back in. in the airbag and then just press it all the and way that's in. the finished product so oem look just like the model s and x inspire feels really nice in the hand and it feels like it belongs in this car so especially you have the front instrument cluster gives you more visibility huge improvement and this new yoke feels really nice in the hand very easy to drive and we'll do a three-point turn here just to show you how easy it is. All right, backing up. And this is all one hand, by the way. So no issue driving this. And I've been driving with the yoke um, for maybe a year, but on and off. Some, some, sometimes the round steering wheel, sometimes the yoke, uh, about 20% of the time the yoke. You just get used to it after, after just a couple weeks, I would say. So very reliable. So if you're interested in this, 30% off right now. So link in the description again, 30% off early Black Friday. Catch you on next time. Remember to subscribe.